in Revive Witch. So, in this video, it's an awakening summon time. Again, in this video, I'm going to spend 1000 souls worth of 10 summons trying to recruit for Ella Dragon Lass. And also, I have something um, news for you regarding why I decide not to do you are hunting in February. I guess the reason, the real reason is because I'm kinda low on large cryolite soul. If I'm getting unlucky 8 times, then I can manage to get the guaranteed ones with just 2000 souls or large cryolite. Depending how many large soul cryolite I have. So as you can see, this I have like 79 souls. And I'm gonna try to spend it everything 8 times. So hoping for the next one I will do that soul summons. And also we have the recollection summons that gives us the new unique weapon for Ella. Finally, I already have it. I'm gonna show you the lab. It's from the March 1. I used the 1000 souls and I got the Blessed Sky immediately. It's indeed in the arid features. Now it goes back from both in 80 summons and 150 and summons respectively. But what I'm going to showcase in this video yet again is this girl, this cute dragon lolly, Ella, dragon lass. This is her life to DR, and she is so cute, even she has the dragon tail and dragon ears, because she is a half dragon, half human. And this is her stats, she has like almost 38k, but do not underestimate this Dan. This Dan is a beast in almost everything, from the Kronos Priest Bridge, um, some um, adventure duels and events. Even she is useful in Dream Worlds too. The reason why she is useful will be explained later she has some decent attack also decent def defenses around like 1.7k to 1.8k so she is gonna be good for balancing and as for her skills the first skill is the scorching breath this is her level 5 in that deals physical damage equal to 400% of attack to all enemies. Dispels their buffs like um like Ruwak. Reduces their attack by 20% for 5 seconds. This is very useful skills. And also when in Dragon Form, also reduces their physical defense by 30% of Ella's attack for 10 seconds. That's really the most terrifying skins in the game right now. And this girl is must have. Also, she can be bought, bought with the Great Daddy. I think in real money before. But now it shifts it towards it not faith. So now you can get Ella for these summons. And she is not exclusive by the way. She can appear after her banner is gone, or most of them. Her second skill called Dragon Blood that can use a red daddy transform skills. This is where she can transform into dragon. This one normal attacks deals damage to all enemies, increases Ella's damage dealt by 50% and her max health by 50%. This is why she is very terrifying in the Chronospace duel. I 
doggies I encounter her most of the time I'm losing. Sometimes I manage to defeat her few times. But since I'm gonna raise my squad, also there is a new um a new thing in this revive which 3.0 is I can immediately enhance a dam quickly than ever before. Which is kinda amazing. Very very amazing thing in this game. And for the passive skill is the ancient inheritance that recovers 5% of max each health seconds and reduces damage taken by 20%. All in all, she is the kinda the front line that the most of the front that can dish all the damages. And she is the destroyer sandstone dance too. I guess she is the perfect team with Tunnel and the other night sandstone dance. Excluding the witch of course. There is lots of mini sandstone dance to be fit with Ella and Tunnel combo. Especially the Sunstone Assassin and also the, um, the rules of getting Ella is much higher but this 50% more you are drop rate than anybody else but she still get the same 2% ratio and also I possibly have most of the SSR dance so expect to be lots of duplicates same as in SR and R rarity ones. Yeah, I indeed got all of them SSR and below. But some of the UR dials I still haven't got it yet because the drop rate is too small, too low. And also the rules, no, the lag of this so much before then. It's in like February 22. Is what I last got is from Judalia until Payphone and also a new doll within Shuffle I like guess the latest member of the of the group or maybe of the collection that is so I guess the I, I don't there is no expectation of I got some new SS dolls or whatever I guess I only need some UR dolls to join me in my quest to become the best. <laughs> okay, I guess enough talk for that. So there is no time to waste then. So in far do I do? Then let's begin summoning. Please, well, to like that's golden, but it's okay. I guess I'm getting some golden petals. So, the first tag to get is cool spinning. Next, you may see. フェイダ。このマソウに近い。お前の力とこの本当の剣。フェイダ。このマソウに近い。お前の力となる。この本当の剣。I guess Ushpia got her first evolution, so it's pretty nice to have her the duplicate version of Ushpia, and also an extra three golden petals. Dina. I guess this is the only that I don't max it yet. At least someday she will be fully evolved. And this is the result of me trying to get for Ella. 
and sadly I still want to risk spend all of my other for lunch Kaila just to recruit her because she is amazing but I guess I'm gonna stop for now so I'm gonna do it for next week then since this video was uploaded so again this is the result of me trying to get Ella and it's kind of pretty okay result whatsoever okay so I guess that's all for this video so thank you for watching so if you like this video then give a like and subscribe to my channel for with summons and also ring the notification bell for the update for the latest videos so see you in the next video so take care everyone